And first, a new fire station. And now Grove's firefighters are moving forward with plans to unionize. Soon, members will have the support of a larger union. The details should be finalized tonight. But what does this mean for firefighters now and even in the future, Jordan? That's right. Those are just some of the concerns we're looking into. And tonight, we're going to get the latest on this one from Gloria Walker. A new fire station and now a new way to negotiate. The city of Groves will meet to approve the firefighters' right to negotiate and bargain their new contracts. You voted on this back in November. Grove City Council will meet today to solidify that the Groves Fire Department will have a right to collectively bargain. Hayden Grove, the president of the union, says this meeting is a formality. And it'll help us uh, be able to work uh, use a negotiation process to obtain the best outcomes in a written contract concerning wages, hours, fringe benefits, uh, discipline, health and safety, and other working conditions for uh, both the firefighters and the city. According to city leaders, this meeting had to take place so they could recognize the union and good news for people who live in Groves. Their taxes won't go up as a result and they will get the same level of emergency response services. And it doesn't change anything because basically, even though they have the right to collectively bargain, they still do not have the right, neither fire or police, to strike. Last weekend, the Groves Fire Department unveiled a new $8.3 million fire station. That with the new collective bargaining agreement, the union president says there's never a better time to be a Groves first responder. I think we're one of the best departments in the area. Uh, we most Recently, we just moved into our brand new fire station. Um, we're getting a new fire truck uh, here pretty soon. So uh, all that together, uh, we have a great city as a whole, but especially the fire department. The city hall meeting took place around 5 this evening. In Groves, Glory Walker, 12 News.